Well, there is a new bipartisan push now to ban military-style body armor at the federal level. Congressman Brian Higgins and Chris Jacobs are among three lawmakers introducing legislation to keep everyday people from buying level three armor. Police say that is the exact same type allegedly worn by the top's gunmen. The bill is being named in honor of Aaron Salter Jr., the retired police officer who was working as a security guard at Topps. Higgins says had the suspected shooter not been wearing body armor, Salter may have been able to stop him. Aaron Salter was a hero. He prevented other people from getting killed, but he was outgunned and he was outarmored. These kinds of incidences, uh, the best that we can do, the least that we can do, is learn from them and take appropriate uh, action as it relates to public policy to ensure that it doesn't happen again. Higgins says with bipartisan support, he's hopeful to get a vote in the House and the Senate.